Live and let die In this video, we're going to be discussing the lymph node. Lymph nodes are spread throughout the entire body. They are, however, more num numerous in certain areas such as the cervical, axillary, and inguinal. And now let's take a closer look at an individual lymph node. While this may look like something that's left over from St. Patrick's Day, it's actually a styrofoam model of a lymph node. A real lymph node looks something like this. The lymph node has an outer fibrous capsule and then there are several indentations called trabeculae. There is an outer cortex and an inner medulla and then these blue buttons represent the germinal centers. Generally there are several afferent lymphatic vessels that drain fluid from the interstitial space entering the lymph node and at the hilum there is one efferent vessel carrying flu fluid away. As a result of many vessels coming in but only one leading out, fluid passage slows down through the lymph node where it is filtered. In the cortex we have T lymphocytes while in the germinal center, we have B lymphocytes, and in the medulla, we mainly have macrophages. 